bunch of war tales. They was scared to pass it. Every hour we gon' share a classic. Dinah, since the shit is on a timer. Witches, pull the baddest bitches. For that pot of gold, no more rocky road. When we were first starting out. you tell them? So, this documentary we shooting right now is based on my new project, The Purple Notebook. The Purple Notebook has really been a long time in the making. Like, it really started back when I was a young boy. Like, when I first started rapping, I wasn't, you know, I wasn't really that good, you know what I mean? I was okay. But as time went on, I started, you know, getting better and better. But I remember this one time when, um, I told my mother I needed some notebooks for school. I said, I need a new notebook, I need a notebook. So she got me a notebook and the notebook was purple. And you know, me, I'm cool. I think I'm, I'm God's gift. <laughs> so I'm like, I'm not taking a purple notebook to school. But I, so basically what I did was decided to use that purple notebook to put my rhymes in, you know what I'm saying? Yo, what up? What up? What's going on, bro? <laughs> Back again, huh? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Another one? Another one. All right. You know what's up? Yeah. What's this project called for you, man? This, uh, this one right here is the Purple Notebook. You know what I mean? Um, hold up. Hold up. I'll be remiss if I didn't uh, let the people know who you are. Yeah. You know what I mean? It's kind of crazy. They can just come in, come in here and start talking about the name of a project that you're going to say name is. Yeah, yeah. I'm a lyrics, man. You already know. <laughs> lyrics. This guy's name is Lyrics. <laughs> what, 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 what's, what's in the name? Tell me what's in the name. Lyrics is, you know, when you think of anybody, you say they name Lyrics, or you think about Lyrics in general. You think about somebody who's not just a pen, who got bars, who, who talks about a lot of things. He's not just stuck in one type of style. You're a oh, lyricist, you know what I mean? You're a lyricist, you know what I mean? So, and one of my OGs told me a long time ago, he said, nigga, if your name gonna be Lyrics, because you better lyrics. be spitting Lyrics. You better have bars. And... At the time when he told me that, I was pretty much a, really an okay rapper. Mm -hmm. So I took that shit to heart. I said, I'm going to step my game up. I'm going to keep this name. <laughs> so, so, hold up. So, what, what made you, like, what made you get into hip hop in that first place? Honest to God, I had two female cousins. Mm -hmm. Bridget and Sean. Bridget dead. Mm -hmm. Got killed in the car crash years ago. But I seen them rock at the, uh, the Ritz and the Lizard. Mm -hmm. First time I ever seen hip hop up close. Nigga was so dope, man, that shit blew me away. I said, I want to do that. And that was how old was you? 11, 12, something like that. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. You're rapping more than half of your life, huh? Hey, that's what you're 22 now, 23? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Right. Yes, sir. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, so, so you said the name of this was Purple Notebook. Yeah. Um, which, how many projects are you on in right now? How many? This is my fifth one. Fifth project. Yeah. What's that? Mean? Yeah. Uh, the first one was the um, Dollar in the Dream mixtape. Okay. Then I dropped one on um, Back to the Basics mixtape. Then I came with the Judy's Boy joint. Right. Uh, Dollar in the Dream loaded. That's that's bumping right now. I like that one. That one loaded. 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 So, um, you start rapping at 12. Yeah. You never been in a group? You like yourself I've been in a bunch of groups, yo. Like, my earliest day, my early days, I was in a group with um, my man Roy B. Viv. Uh, shout out to B. Viv. Okay. So, we was like the, the new balance crew. <laughs> balance crew. <laughs> yeah, I was kid knowledge. <laughs> Matter of fact, when me, Roy, with my man Matt Cleave, Matt Cleave was beatbox unique. <laughs> Know yeah, 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 know yeah, yeah. So from there, then I was in a group with um called the Illustrious Three. It was me, Shorty Fresh, and my man Billy Brown. He a passing now, God bless him. You know what I mean? He's still my man. You know what I mean? And um, there I was solo for mad long, honestly, for a lot of years. But then um I got in a group in the '90s called the Union. It was six of us. You know what I mean? 
Yeah, so, so shout out to everybody in the end. So I did that for maybe like two years, but solo is a good way for me, you know what I'm saying? I, I just, Bruce is cool, but it's too much to go with it. Everybody got egos, and everybody feel like their opinion matters, and everybody else can, you know what I mean? It's just too much. So I'm better, I'm better off on my own, you know what I mean? So, um, so you like the only, you don't rap in your family, you don't have rap cousins? I got, I, got, I got a couple cousins that rap, you know what I mean? <laughs> and they're pretty good, though. They're pretty good. I don't take nothing away from them, you know what I mean? They, they nice like you, though? It's half nice, nice. half is nice. Half, some, of them, some of them is, a few of them is, like, above average, you know what I mean? But, you know. And you have sing? And you have uh, You know, yeah, a lot, of them, a lot of my cousins sing, you know what I mean? Sister sing, you know. But, uh, you got a lot of talent in the family. A lot of talent. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, you got uh, your sister sing good? Is she, is she, she nice with it? She, yeah, she ain't no Gladys Knight now. But <laughs> <laughs> nah, but she's pretty good, man. Y'all probably know her, you know what I mean? Anybody that don't know me, anybody that know me should know her, you know what I mean? Paying from the group total, you know what I mean? What's that? Hold up, man. You're changing, you're changing the whole landscape now. <laughs> your sister's paying from total. Paying from total. You lyrics. Yeah. From the union, yeah, and all of the, the threes and the illustrious threes, and yeah, all, all that, all that. Yeah. Oh, yeah. What the hell is going? What's all of this talent, though, man? Like, hey, man. My mama has a, <laughs> she has, I don't know, she has some good genes, some good chromosomes, somehow. So, so y'all got joints together? You and you and your sister? We got a few that we did um, a while back, but it's funny. We just had a conversation yesterday. Mm-hmm. She said we need to put a project out together. So, you think about doing that, you know what I'm saying? You think about doing that. So. But we're going to do it, you know what I mean? We just got to um, get the right timing because she got a lot of things going on now. And I got a lot of things going on. So. But it's going to happen. It's definitely going to happen. That's what's up. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? So, I start putting the rhymes in there, you know what I mean? And my cousin Derek, he was living with me at the time. So, he, he, he thought I was a decent rapper, but... I, I said something to him that I put out in that notebook, that I wrote in that the purple notebook. And he's like, yo, that's hot, that's hot, that's hot. So, you know, I wrote another one. He's like, yeah, that's fire. Then I remember I wrote something over the Scarface beat, man. Cause I was a great storyteller. So I wrote a, a story over this, I forgot what Scarface song, Scarface song it was. But when I wrote that, he was like, yo, you fire, boy. You better keep writing in that purple notebook. You know what I mean? So I was soup. So then, like my, when I, one of my um, other cousins, Rachel, she was more like a sister to me. Like, I've been in high school by house and spit raps all the time. And um, so I spit a couple of joints out of the Purple Notebook. And she was like, boy, that Purple Notebook, you need to keep writing in there. I don't know what that's doing for your pen or your thoughts or whatever, but stay in that Purple Notebook. You know what I mean? So, so Purple Notebook. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Drop and win. We're going to drop the first week in May, the first weekend. I forgot that date, but... Mm-hmm. That's when we come. And why exactly is it supposed to It's just a, um... How, wait, how old is these lyrics, man? Is they like some outdated shit that you, you know, you wrote it in purple crown and... Nah, bro. Alright, explain this. I was at the lab last night, putting the finishing touches on it. So you got some new stuff. Yeah, brand right, new. So, anything so, so tell me why it's called the purple notebook. Well, the, the purple notebook, man, it's like, it's like a, um... It's personal. Mm-hmm. Cause this been a, uh, this been in the making since I was a young lad. You mm-hmm. know what I'm saying? Like when I first start rhyming, uh, um, you know everybody's writing a notebook, or whatever. Mm-hmm. But I remember one time I needed a notebook for school, and I told my mother I need a, I need a notebook. So she bought me a purple notebook. I said I'm not taking no purple notebook out this house. You crazy? <laughs> so I was like I don't want to waste your money. So I said yeah, yeah, yeah. I just write my rhymes. You know what I'm saying? So. She know that she didn't use right runs in the front one. No, she was all cool. She the told me. Wasted my money. But then you're right in the back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I kept that hidden real well. well. You know what I mean? But I don't know. I, when I started writing that purple notebook, it just I felt like I went up a level. And like my cousin Derek, who lived with me from North Carolina and shit, but he, he came to live with us. You know, he was he real hard to please when it comes to music. You know what I mean? So he would always say, You okay, you okay. But I wrote something in that purple notebook and I spat it, I spat it for him. 
That's good. Yeah, yeah you, you definitely a lyricist because you, know, just, you, know, you said you spat it. Yeah. And I wouldn't have said spat it. Yeah. I would have said I spit it. <laughs> but you spat it. I spat it. Oh, yeah. Yeah. That's what's up, though. You know, I'm a word nerd. I'm about into yeah. words and word, word usage nerd. and all that Come stuff. On, you know what I mean? Stop rapping with me, though. This is an interview. All right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, not, it's not spat. It's spit it. It's anything. It's not word nerd. It's, yeah, I'm not yeah. at all. You should see when I write around, honestly, not to jump off subject, I be so... I be making sure that I don't misuse words and the sentence structure gotta be like I'm writing an essay. Like I don't know, that don't, that don't put, that's, that's a, uh, it don't, it don't put to go like that. You know what I mean? You can't put these tough words together like that. I be so. Yeah, only, only on uh, word nerds name, lyrics, lyrics, and stuff like that. Yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. Um, so who you work with on this, matter of fact, you work with, uh, I know you worked on your, your previous projects with uh, K Black. Yeah. You work with on this one. K Black, man. Oh, I mean. K Black, K Black is your go to. That's your yeah, that's, right. that's, that's my drill right there. Yes, sir. I yes, do. Yes, <laughs> that's what you're doing, now, man. You know? uh, your network has got the crazy. That's yeah, 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 yeah. That's what you're doing. <laughs> so, um, Joint is coming out and anything um, soon. Work with K Black. Who would you, you got any pre features on this joint? Uh-huh. Yeah, I got a few. I got, uh, but they all in-house, though, you know what mm-hmm. I mean? I, I keep my family tight, mm-hmm. my circle tight, you know what I mean? So I got my man K-Ron, King K, rather, mm-hmm. King K, you know what I mean? Who also devils, that's my videographer. <laughs> I said that right. I can say that, but it's not you right. Yeah, so I did, I got, I got my bro Matt Cleave on there, mm-hmm. you know what I mean? That's the whole, that's the bro right there. Right. Then I got, um... My man Donnie, that's my crooner. He, he, he come through on the books, so I need to bless me with some ballads or mm-hmm. any, you know what I mean, some notes. And then um, I got my young boy Amaze on there. We did a song called FOH. That joint is about to be out of here. FOH. Yeah, fuck out of here. That's for, yeah, that's for the young kids, right? Yeah, that's, young. The young, that's for the youngest. That's for the best. Yeah, yeah. That's for the, the college kids. Had, had to get him something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, and that's... that's that's pretty much it. You know, I know I got Young Matt because I got that U record. That's the song okay. that I'm so Young Matt. Mm-hmm. Shout out to Young Matt. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, that's my joint. I listened to that double day. I thought, ooh, summer, summer work. Yeah, summer yeah, work. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So yeah. definitely, definitely. But that, that's pretty much it, man. The rest of it was just me. That's what's up. Yeah. So, um, so what's next for you, man? So after this, man. Yeah. I ain't gonna say too much about it, but I'm gonna be on TV in like July. I can't speak too much on that. On BET though. I'm done. But uh I'm done. I'm done. <laughs> on BET. Still B E T man in July, you know what I mean? And um I'm gonna keep putting out these projects, man. I got I got the um Dollar and Dream winning ticket coming out, mm-hmm. probably September. Um So it's like a series of Dollar and a Dream. Yeah, 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 yeah. What's up? Yeah. And then um top of the late this year or the top of the year, I'm gonna drop an LP called uh, uh, About Damn Time. Mm-hmm. But in the meantime, too, I got an um, EP I'm about to do with my boy Donnie. EP with Sus Pan. Mm-hmm. And um, also an EP with my boy Matt Thieves. So be busy. And oh, I forgot one, too. Um, my boys from Asbury Park, we in Asbury right now. Mm-hmm. Shout out to them, because we about to do an EP called The Corona Season, too. So, you know, too. So. Yeah. Yeah. So my bro, we about to cast a draw So she could chase whatever she got a passion for These niggas mad cause we rapping more Eyes watching God, seen exactly what the actress saw Told beef, I feel like they be fasting more Try to lower the case, but now they capping more Have a pause, but on my bond if they play me Better be 2K and you got Brian and AD It's crazy, these niggas singing but they missing notes I keep drumming like Phil, just using different strokes Shit is dope, if I lose it's probably fixed Niggas cry when they broke And now they bloody rich I doubt he spit I don't play with these hermaphrodites Mumbling Like when Hove hit a track he likes Bad advice to try and pair me With these man's kids Had this 357 For a hammer dead This analyst said she loved my soul I don't spit the drug stories Like the ones y'all told He supposed to be old Spit until we at the gates You holler gang Get shot and won't retaliate If that's the eighth I'll hit it If the shit's exotic You gotta know it's not a plan If it's missing logic this project getting treated like the top pick. My brother Aaron got me somewhere in his top six. Yeah, I don't know how I feel. All right. <laughs>